which is in the bottom of Australia, so it's in the southeastern corner, about three hours from Melbourne. We are really small. Most of our students are on farms and they get bused to school. So we have 250 students and they are from prep to year 12. So that's <coughs> five right through to 18. So if you go out our back gate of our school, that is what you would see. So it's just very rural, very small town. We are culturally and geographically isolated. But each of our students now has a netbook. So can you see my mouse pointing to the netbook uh, people? Yes. Okay, so each student from grade five right through to year 12. So this lizard, when it pokes its tongue out, has a blue tongue. And you can actually see the blue tongue on the video camera. So the, the school in Russia actually brought in their handcraft. They did a folk dance for us. And we actually ended up being on their television news that night. That night. That's why she wanted the, um, the kangaroo. So we've actually linked up with them quite a bit. That teacher now teaches in a military school in Russia. So we've actually Skyped with the boys who are going to be soldiers for Mongolia and for Russia. And we've talked about the, with them about what they learned at school and they've learned about our school. This is Belinda, one of the girls in year uh, nine. So she was 15. She's playing her guitar for the Russian students because they wanted to hear yeah. our culture. So Australia has Vegemite. Have you heard of Vegemite? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so it's a very bitter taste, but we spread it on uh, savouries and toast. So Alana is showing they enjoyed it so much that for 10 weeks, each week, they would come in at lunchtime and they would work with the author from New York and he would set them tasks, writing tasks and activities that they would do and then they would share with him online using Evernote. He would then read what they'd done. The next week we'd come back and he'd tell them how they went and give them ideas for improvement. So each student would come up one at a time and speak to them about what they'd done that week. And he would talk to them about how he felt they could improve their work. So I'm going to unplug the cable in a minute, Chris, so it might pull me off. But I'll ask the questions first. But these are some of the things I love to use is to keep a record of what I'm doing. So can you see what I've got in my hand? Is that coming up all right? Yes. So it's a flip video. So just, and then I can record. But what I can do is pull off the end and it's a USB. So it plugs straight in my computer. And it's a file that I can use for podcasting. And I love my camera. I use my camera a lot to try and capture what I'm doing. So that's what I do with Skype. So do you have any questions? We have about, oh, we have a few minutes. <laughs> Now we can still see it's a bit, it's a bit whitish because of the exposure and the webcam, but we can see fine. Okay, I'm going to take you and show you our cow. I'll introduce you to our library. Hey, Faye. <laughs> oh, the cow got on the cow's gone. This is Faye, our librarian. Hi. 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 So these people are from Singapore. Okay. Oh, oh our cow has gone. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Lost the cow. <laughs> we have a cow at the yard. Uh, but can you see? The totem pole. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. So our students paint that. Now if I spin you around, that's our playground. Oh. 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 But you see it's got a shade, a sun cloth because of our heat. Um, so we have a lot of them. And behind me is the library. Oh, you can still see Faye. So is that the library there? And you just see it's just beautiful and real. I'll just take you out the front door and then I'll have to go. Thanks, babe. <laughs> so I'm now going back into the school through the canteen. But can you see how this is rather magical? Uh, 
Yeah, we're still with you. Want to look inside? I'll see if we're not allowed inside. Hang on a minute. Well, Adam, can we just come in? Oh, yeah. This is our uh, canteen lady, Leanne. Hi, how are you? Hi. And look at what she's making. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, Australian gum tree. So I think you should show up. Is that? Oh, yes. That, that's school emblem. It's just beautiful. I'll see if I can go a bit closer for you. Is that better? Yep, a little bit. Yeah, it's really quiet, isn't it? Yes. But that's a rule. It's just all country where we are at school. And that's brilliant. So in, do, do, do your colleagues think you're a bit crazy walking around the school with a laptop? <laughs> yeah. Kids do too. <laughs> <laughs> we are the children. Oh yeah, where are the children? They've gone home, I think, haven't they? They've gone home because it's um, our school finishes at three thirty. So it's now three thirty. It's now four o'clock, isn't it? Yes, yeah, it's four o'clock. So the kids have been gone home half an hour ago. What time do you finish school? One thirty. One thirty. Yeah, so it's exactly the same.